YouTube, you know what my biggest pet peeve is? And I don't mean this to be racist at all. It's just, in my building, there's a lot, a lot of foreigners. And the only reason why it irritates me, because when I come home at 11.30 at night, I don't want to smell burnt curry down the hallways. I don't want to smell really, really weird incense that make me want to throw up. I don't want to hear obnoxious banging and yelling down the hallways in languages I don't even understand at 5 or 6 o'clock in the fucking morning. I am sick and tired of hearing birds. My cat is to the point where it's also every time we hear we'll be laying in bed and every time we hear banging I'll go <sighs> and he will just do this growl like that noise which pretty much indicates that he is pissed off. It's I don't know if I should make a complaint or not, but it's annoying. You know, some people do sleep in. I understand that I sleep in far way too much than I should, but you know, I can't get to sleep sometimes. You should at least have the dear common dignity and courtesy to not be so loud. There are people in this building who have children, and there's are people in the building who are like me, who wear crazy hours and don't go to bed till late in the morning, and don't want to be wake up two hours after actually falling asleep because you can't keep your kids under control, or you can't use your indoor voice. I have no idea how people get off thinking that is acceptable to do that. I'm just, I had it. And I've actually made complaints about some of the banging and yelling and screaming and running down the halls that happen early in the morning. I also have called the Humane Society because there's an old lady on my floor who thinks it's okay to leave there tiny little dog that does not have much fur out on the balcony whimpering for two hours. That is unacceptable. If my cat, who doesn't even like any other animals other than chihuahuas because he thinks they're cats, if he's at the window whimpering and actually having sympathy for this animal that he doesn't like, there is a big problem. Not only do I feel bad, but if my cat is actually off his lazy butt and complaining at the window because the other animal, there is a problem. And I am very shocked to know that the lady didn't even get a slap on the wrist. She did that. Just remember this, just slap on the wrist. She got no fine, she just got talking to. And this, I've called three times. And I'm just fed up. <laughs> Fed, fed the fuck up.